Hey there YouTube, it's your boy here, Carrie Fiber, and today I'm going to be doing a sixth review on six star pre-workout explosion, the Ice Rocket Freeze. There you go, and as you know, I never receive any energy off of these pre-workout supplements, and the only reason is because is because I am so tolerant to caffeine, because I mean I consume at least 1,000, 1,500 milligrams of caffeine a day. So pre-workout is not going to give me the energy like it might give other people. So I can't speak on the behalf of the energy coming from pre-workouts. But what I can say is, is the beta alanine and the aggressiveness that you feel in the gym when you're on pre-workout. Now 6-star is not as an aggressive as a pre-workout as like bucked up. So I'm going to say that first. Now if bucked up products... I get that aggressiveness in the gym for like 30 minutes and then it wears off. And I really love the aggressiveness feeling that you get when you're on bucked up. And that's due to the Alpha GPC for the focus. Unfortunately, 6 Star Products does not have Alpha GPC and it does not give me any focus at all at the gym. Now, I felt a little bit of focus the first time I took like three scoops of the 6 Star pre-workout uh, fruit punch. But with this right here, I thought this would actually be pretty good. I thought it would taste good. This is the 6-star Icy Rocket Freeze. <laughs> Unfortunately, I took two scoops and didn't feel a thing. I felt like one tingle from the beta alien. That was it. And the taste, the, the first taste is alright. The aftertaste tastes like you just swallowed a bunch of toothpaste. <laughs> so I'm actually going to give this a negative review don't waste your money on it. I mean, it might be good for you if you're not so tolerant to caffeine as, as I am. You might actually get some energy off of it. But other than that, that's about it. Um, I felt nothing off of this. I didn't feel the beta alanine. I mean, I felt, like I said, like one tingle. And I just wasted 15 bucks on this. Straight garbage. Maybe I need to take another scoop. So I'll let you know. I'm going to take three scoops before I go to the gym today. And I'll let you know how I feel. I don't recommend you taking more than two scoops. And recommended serving is two scoops. But for somebody like me who is so tolerant to caffeine and beta alanine, I'm going to have to take three scoops. Now, good news is, is on the six star fruit punch, I did feel the beta alanine. Down, Jerry. Sorry about that, my dog. But um, I did feel the beta alanine in the six star fruit punch. I do recommend this for like if you're a beginner. Definitely try 6-star products before you try anything else, because 6-star products are beginner-friendly, especially with the pre's. Um, you're, if, if you don't drink energy drinks, like, day in and day out like I do, you will feel the caffeine probably. But, like I said, I'm very tolerant to caffeine. I have a high tolerance for it, where I drink it, and I've been drinking it for years. But 6-star is a great product to start out with first for pre-workouts. But do not try this one. I mean, it's up to you. Each to their own. But I would not recommend it. 15 bucks, garbage. I'm going to take it just to say I finished it. You know, that's it. But I do recommend 6-star Fruit Punch pre-workout. And it's got the same amount, though. This has got the same amount of beta alanine and caffeine and everything else in it as the Fruit Punch does. Just didn't feel it. Just didn't feel shit. And the taste is horrible. Very horrible. I mean, it was like a toothpaste taste in the back of my throat, like a minty, for like 30, 45 minutes until I could finally get all that taste. I just kept chugging water and then I mixed some BCAs on top of it. And, oh, nasty. Disgusting. <laughs> but yeah, if you like this video and you want more honest videos like this, leave a comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And that's it for right now.